Okay, so my thing said memory card error. I don't know what you got of that. I cut the tree down. It worked. Chainsaw worked. Yay. Now I gotta pull the truck up closer so I can cut some of this down and load it up to cart off. I'm trying to be patient with this uh, memory card. It keeps cutting off for some reason. It says memory error, memory card error. I'm doing this in sections, chopping it up. You get the idea. Okay, so I've cut down some limbs on this side. I need to make a, a trip to the dump. I think this tree is gonna take about three trips to the dump at least, maybe four. Um, I cut up as much as I could fit into here and uh, I got it pretty loaded down. I'm gonna go to the dump, drop these off and come back and get some more. They close at seven and it's four o'clock, so, or three o'clock, so I better, I better get to it. All right, that little electric chainsaw is doing the trick. Um, I did have to take it apart a couple times and put it back together because uh, it keeps coming off the uh, holder, mainly dirty due to user error because I got it pinched between stuff. But uh, that's what's left. Um, I'm about to take my second trip to the dump. You know, it's kind of sticking up there, but uh, it ain't going anywhere. I ain't got to drive anything under anything uh, low. But uh, I think one more trip and I'll have the rest of this. So yeah, good day. And just like that, folks, it is gone. G-O-N-E, gone. <clears throat> it took a tremendous amount of energy. And my little, uh, my little gas-powered home light 14-inch uh, electric chainsaw did great. Uh, I didn't know if it would actually work. It only cost me 50 bucks at um, Home Depot. But, uh, yeah, it did the trick. I will say that the chain popped off a few times and that was a little disturbing uh, i kept having to put it back on before i realized that the little catch wasn't catching there's a little nub in there it's supposed to catch so that you can tension it up and i didn't realize it wasn't quite catching uh <clears throat> i wore my stupid sun hat today so that hopefully i can wait uh fend off the the horrible skin cancers of the world it is needing an oil change a little, yeah. Hmm. I need to spray some Febreze in there. <sighs> but anywho, that's how I spent my day off today. I'm gonna go inside and get cleaned up and call it call it an evening. Um, it's lovely weather out here today. <sighs> today is April 11th. Uh, my youngest boy turned 21 yesterday. Happy birthday, Jacob. Love you. Um, and uh. It's short weather today. We've had really cold weather the last couple days. I'm talking like in the 40s is a high. And then today, uh, the high is like 67. It's beautiful. Beautiful. I think uh, Thursday and Friday it's supposed to get near 80. And then cold again this weekend. It's like, uh, it's like trying to get there. It's like, I'm coming. Just hang on. So, anywho, I thought I was going to get the grass cut today, too. I overestimated uh, how much time it was going to take to get that tree up. But that's fine. The tree's up and those little limbs are up and I ain't got to worry about it. Limbs falling on me while I'm cutting grass now. Um, but I did, uh, I did fight with that stupid Bolin's weed eater for a while and give up on it. And specifically went to Home Depot so I could get me a electric weed eater. This one's a Black and Decker, and look, it's got the it's got the thing where you can weed eat like normal, and then you can turn it sideways and you can edge. I like that. I got some old uh, attachments that go to Ryobi that I don't need anymore. I may uh, I may post those online and sell them to whoever wants them. 
So, anywho, I'm gonna get cleaned up. Thanks for watching my silly self. I'm, I'm always surprised that you guys stick in there to hang around and I do appreciate you. Y'all have a great day.